camera. Come on, let me look into the camera. You already know who I am. You already know what this is about. You know, I'm not going to speak no spoken words right this second. But um, this is just me giving some words of wisdom or, you know, whatever I can contribute to your life this second. You know, sometimes we just need somebody to speak to us. You know, even when we're in our lowest moments, you know, even when we give up on ourselves, we just need somebody to pull us up. Because right now I'm in a point in my life I'm just trying to refocus. You know, I'm a 33-year-old man, you know, hey, I put it out there. You know, staying with his family, you know, just trying to figure it out, working, working at a job, you know, that I would, you know, you know, that I care for, but I would rather be doing something else. You know, just trying to find myself and just letting anybody know that you can find yourself, no matter how many people doubt you, no matter what you go through, no matter what things happen, you can still learn, you can still grow, you know, um, you know, it's, it's not too late. If you got life in your lungs and, you know, uh, mobility in your body, then it's always a way to do what it is that you could do. You know, it's just that we have to get past the struggles and the naysayers and even ourselves. Sometimes we're our worst enemies. And sometimes when people see weakness in us, they equate that for, you know, being the total part of us. You know, just like if you let a person see you as weak, then they'll, you know, always, you know, see you as a weak person or can see you be that way. And sometimes you could just be going through a dry spell. Sometimes you could just be having a weak moment, you know, but it's not really up to that person to motivate you and push you to become who you need to be. You have to find it in yourself to become who you need to be. You have to find the motivation, you know, be it in the things you watch, the things you eat, you know, what you do, who you hang around, the things you put in your body, you know, the, the environment, the atmosphere that you're around. I mean, because it can happen to us all. But the difference between those that succeed and those that don't, you know, because we all fall, it's the ones that get up again and get up again. And when nobody thought that you, you know, you could succeed or do it, it's to still be going at it and still be fighting for it long after people, you know, after people have, you know, already given up. You know, and, and that's what I'm trying to do. Long after people have written me off and say, hey, he's not doing too much. He's living a mediocre life. He's not doing too much for himself. You know, maybe he'll be okay or have a kid here or do this here or whatever the case may be. That's when you strike. You go your hardest when nobody believes in you. And then you, you go with that your most. And then when people start to believe in you and start to, you know, come at you with success and things like that, you get humble and not big headed. And that's what I hope to be, just humble and not big headed as the success comes, as the money comes, you know, if fame comes out of it, whatever comes out of this, enemies, anything, you know. But it's about me just trying to discover who I am and be of a benefit to the world. And I apologize to anybody that I may have hurt or done anything to presently, past, future, you know, because I go through things just like anybody else. I'm not perfect. I'm not perfect and I will make mistakes. And if you're mad at me for making mistakes, then all I can tell you is only God can really truly judge me, you know, and I don't want to hurt anybody. And I'm not trying to hurt anybody in any mistakes that I've made anybody. You know, I'm trying to be a good person. Not always I'm not going to be perfect. Who knows? I may do something stupid after this video is over. But the whole point of it is, it's after that moment, we can still move on and do different things with our life. We can still grow. We can still overcome if you're willing to dust yourself off and, and, and see what's going on around the corner and just stick around to the end of the show. Who knows? You may get a surprise ending. You know, maybe you may go from being a stagehand to the start of the show. You never know. Or playing a pivotal role in life. That's what I'm trying to find out. I don't know. I'm Mel Mel and I approve this message. Mm.